This moth I am holding is the Elm Sphinx, also known as the Four-Horned Sphinx, for the four large horn-like projections found on its caterpillar. And one look at this moth and you can see it is aerodynamic and built for speed. With a wingspan of up to four and a half inches, this is also one of the larger hawk moths. It takes only a month for this species to go from egg to pupation, eating birch, elm, pepper, and tomato plants, among others. The caterpillar comes in two colors, a green form and a brown form, and in warmer areas they may have up to two generations per year, flying in June and July in the north and again in March through October in the south. This species is an earth pupator, meaning instead of weaving a cocoon on a tree or plant for protection, it will go underground and make a small cell in which to pupate, using the dirt as protection around itself until it emerges in the spring. The colors on this moth are quite attractive. They look as if they were painted and then flew off at high speed, streaking the wet paint down their wings. The moth is very content to be handled in bright light, as if mesmerized, although the moment you move to a darker area, they can become quite active and uncooperative. So now that he has been so patient with me, I will let him go on his way. After one more look at his cute face and large dark eyes, they're always a pleasure to see.